Here's meteorologist Tom Atkins. As we start the main weather segment, we will start down at the dock, Dobbins Landing, Dias Auto and Truck Camera, looking at the Bicentennial Tower, the whiteness on the bay there. And then we take a look uh, over downtown Edinburgh, very quiet on our Sam Catania painting camera, Meadville Street, down towards the Borough Hall, the church. Uh, just a decently quiet night because the snow has been in Buffalo. It's not as intense as it was. But there's other snow, not necessarily lake effect, that's brewing to the west. But as we dive in closer to home, for now, we're just fine. So let's get into it. Here's our little system that's going to come across late tonight and tomorrow. Not tremendous amounts of snow, but uh, we'll just take our overnight model and into tomorrow to show you that by daybreak, you know, this general light snow overspreads the region. It's with us tomorrow, and then it starts to fracture up towards uh, the evening. So what we have from the National Weather Service are winter storm warnings for some heavier amounts, Erie, Crawford, Ashtabula, winter weather advisories, Mercer, Venango, Forest, Warren, McKean. Uh, conspicuously, Buffalo is not weighed in on any advisories or warnings for their counties at this point. So what we can say is it's just winter, tonight into Sunday. So it's like two and a half to three days Snow will come in waves. It'll be eventually shovelable, plowable. The streets eventually getting snow covered in slippery. And the heaviest will fall in the snow belt south of 90. But again, it's a process into Sunday morning. And then after that, it just gets warmer. So right now, the temperature is just flat lining near 25. No great shakes there. They'll dip a little Saturday and then... The warm-up begins as we go into Monday and Tuesday. So 25 and 20 are highs and lows. So we'll get some snow at times over the next few days, but nothing really unusual for us. As we show you the temperatures here, Erie and Chautauqua County, 18 to 25 across the board. Uh, Southern Erie and Crawford County, 21 to 24, and out to the east in uh, Venango and Warren County, 17 to 22. So where do we go from here? Buffalo has had the snow. Uh, we're going to get a little bit here uh, in northern Erie County, and then the wind shift to the north and west, and that will drive on Saturday and Saturday night with a combination of Lake Huron and Lake Erie, the heavier snows into the snow belt. So as you go into Saturday, we build it up slowly, and then we look for these kind of things to knife in Saturday and Saturday night, providing some higher accumulations uh, before it moves out on Sunday. So for tonight, a half inch to two inches by morning. Morning, 16 to 22. For tomorrow, general light snow, 1 to 3 along the lakeshore, maybe 4 in some spots, uh, 25 if you're south of 90, Edinburgh, Meadville, Greenville, 1 to 3 inches of snow. And if you're in the east, Jamestown, Warren, Tyanesta, 1 to 2 inches tomorrow, 21 to 24. And again, just to add another inch for tomorrow night. So this snow is manageable tomorrow and tomorrow night. Saturday's the worst day. It drops into the snow belt. It's colder. It's blustery. The heavier accumulation south of 90. Sunday, the flakes fade. It's still cold. Monday is dry and above freezing. And Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we just climb the ladder. A lot of clouds, but maybe just rain showers off and on through that time period as we experience our January thaw. And, of course, you can check out the uh, seven-day there and a lot of other weather information on the Your Erie to Go app. It's going to be nice to see the Give the shovels sun. a break. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. After two whole days of work or so. <laughs> yeah, I know. Thank you, Tom.